Reaction though, no reaction. All right, you guys, we're back with Sisters Reunited. So again, these are Brock's two dogs, and if you said, what, how do they, they don't like each other. And if you said, what are you basing on? Well, that growl right there is an indication to me. And it's gonna try to jack with this dog, and she's purposely kind of hanging behind you. She's purposely healing along. So what you've got to be careful with when you got this is trying to do recall when that one's going to come in from the side and take this one out or something. Oh, let's see if she get out there and swim. Though Breck hadn't seen her swim. He didn't see that video. We actually got so much media that no one, there's, there's actually no human being on the planet that's actually viewed all my media, Breck. <laughs> what? No human being on the planet has ever actually viewed all my media. Not even me! That's a farm boy, he just washes his hands in the pond. He doesn't need soap. He uses the sand. He was in, were you in Boy Scouts? No. You weren't? No, we didn't do Boy Scouts at that time. Oh, 4-H though, right? Yeah, we did the 4-H thing for a little bit. Yeah, 4-H was great. Is it bike week? Uh, All right, Brett, tell me who won the Daytona 500. That's how far out of touch I am. You were at work. Uh, Brock doesn't even know he was at work. I don't know. <laughs> I know Tony Gibson is a screw chief. Tony Stewart won? Uh, well, I didn't know. All right, look, you're going to... The fish following us. All right, so you know how I say the recall. You're going to have to just try to mimic it as best as possible, but... Just kind of maybe let them kind of see if they'll kind of drift off and you kind of drift back that way. Oh no, the shepherd's all over. All right, watch out, she's stepping in ants. All right, come on. Oh no, she goes all the way out there now. Oh, Sophia's here. Anyway, I told Brock to give you a shout out. I hope you saw it. <laughs> No, I told Breck you're coming oh, to visit. Oh, there's that big one. You're I'm taking about. you to Norwoods. Right I know. I told Breck there's a big fish. He didn't believe me. No, I made him. Uh, I made Breck give a shout out to you in the last video, Sophia. I told him how you think we have an American accent and how you love it. The Sophia character loves America. She's like, no, I don't. Yes, you do. <laughs> you love American accents. Yeah, she saw. It. Oh, she saw it. Anyway, it's a beautiful day. Rex dressed. Uh, his character was supposed to be more brightly dressed. Ha! And he's like, go to... He was at work all night. 20 hours? 20 hour shift. No, going on 20 hours about right now. Oh, he's been up for 20 hours. He's 30 years old. If you can't do it now, man, good Lord. Right. He's looking for empathy. He's not getting it. He's not getting it. All right, so stay right there. I want you to see if I if we can get her a little farther. You're gonna if you walk that way and do call her name and keep going though and do it like the handoff. She's gonna come big though. All right, get ready. Start walking. All right, go faster. All right, really holler for. Her. Look out! Look out! <laughs> gonna be hit by a missile. <laughs> All right, come back this way. If she starts, to, I'm going to tell you when. Don't call her until I tell you, but yeah, that thing's a bullet. You know, I think I figured it out even more, Mike. When I look back at my old recall videos, I, I, I wonder why. How are you so stupid that you couldn't figure out how to make? Maybe I didn't want it to go faster. Maybe I didn't understand faster was better. All right, now just stay right there, being different so she doesn't go. I wanted her to go out there and swim so you can see her swim. I'm going to do some photos in a minute. She's probably going to go out there. You know, but again, you know, I think if you're giving the handler certain specific moves, such as moving away and doing stuff like that, you're better off than telling somebody, stand there and blurt out, Kalua, come, and thinking it's going to race over there. You know, I think if you have to view that you're training this dog to be handled by a handler. And who is my handler? You know, everybody is not gonna be, you know, a 30 year old fit deputy sheriff like Bragg. I mean, yeah, it works for him, but it's not gonna work for other people. You know, and you may have to overcompensate, you know, for certain handlers. <laughs> That's an understatement. 
All right, get ready. Start going the other way, Breck. Be gone. Get gone. Go. Get gone. All right, holler. Yeah. Tell you what, you got yourself a bullet coming right. <laughs> Oh, God. What happened was your shepherd got hit by a freight train. Yeah. Oh, no. She didn't see that one coming. Yeah. No, she mad now. She mad now. No, she clued you, you know. And if you said that speaks to your recall, I'd say, yeah, it really does. I mean, she's freight trained her. You know, but I think that's what you've got to think of. Oh, here's the big fish right here, Breck. Look. Yeah, I see him. Um, you'll, you'll see when you look back at this, Breck, you got a freight train coming right at you. Oh, yeah. oh no, that shepherd was going to run interference, but it didn't work when she went flat on the ground when she got hit in the side. All right, guys, we're going to go. We're going to take some pictures. And I, it's time for me to throw Breck out. So this is our relationship. Bye, you're leaving now. No. <laughs> Breck's like, yeah. <laughs> Goodbye, you're leaving now. <laughs> That's how you have to be with your dog, you know? Not goodbye, I'm so sad. All right, look, there's Skylar. He's just always kind of there. He is always. It's scary, Breck. And when he wasn't there, he was at the neighbor's house. That's the scary part. Luann brought him over on the golf cart. Now, every time you see a big one, then there's a bigger one. Anyway, but you can see the Billy Joe Armstrong effect is transferring. It's transferring pretty well, don't you think, Breck? She seems to. She's forgotten about me for right now because yeah. you're playing that role. Uh, you know, I, it's, people need yeah. to understand. It's it's all a story. It's a soap opera that they're living in. If you don't think characters are interchangeable, you know, when people say I have a special bond and all these things, the only way that would be if the only person that Doug did that for was you. And that's not really helping training at all if you're not really talking methodologies to. Well, if you're a companion dog trainer, I think you should think of your profession as, you know, developing methodologies that work across the board regardless of the handler that take into account uh, that nobody knows anything about dogs. Yeah. <laughs> you factor that in, it's fine. <laughs> Am I wrong? Nope. Okay, guys, we're going to get some quick pics, but anyway, Sophia loved it, and Sophia said hello, but the way she says it was, hello. <laughs> she's like, that's not how I talk, lady. Anyway, she's going to come visit, and, oh, we're going to, we're going to, she's going to come visit whenever uh, Dave or Ben Nichols or somebody's coming to town, and we're going to, Sophia's going to experience the American Indie Rock Concert, because she already, because she probably knows more about that kind of stuff than we do, because those bits know more about rock music than we do. All right, girl, I'll talk to you on Messenger later. Bye, Mike.